that it's been approved in your, that's fine. In right. your book. Yeah. All, all the, the Old Testament. That's what you're doing. My friend, where are you from? Are you I, I, where are you from? You're a nice person. I like I, talking I, to you. I, I'm, I'm going to talk I, nicely to you. Okay. 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 Are you Syrian? No, I'm not. Oh, Iraqi. No. no, okay. But if I say Allah, I say Allah, I say it's okay. I, I don't want to go me. into that. It's for no, you. I know it's for you. I know it's for you. It's you all right. Okay. Some, yeah, okay, I respect you. I respect you. I respect you. I some, some Muslims, they say, oh, you have to say I that. I don't mind. But some Muslims oh, you say don't that. have to. No, no it's okay. But brother, if you say in the name of God and you stand in the Holy Spirit, I'm not going to say to you, I'm not going to worship you. Pathetic. No, I'm not going to say it like you say. Okay. So I wouldn't no, no, say no. it. Okay. No, I was only saying, how are you, brother? All right. My friend, I was only saying that I don't want to say that because it's not. Uh, for me, uh, Muhammad is nothing like uh, close to anything like a prophet or anything. That's, that's for you. Now, when, yeah. but you know what? This whole conversation can be very productive if there is. We establish. I'm to find out for you, please. Because obviously, I don't have a solid no evidence, it's as okay. you say. As, as you ask a valid thank question. You. I appreciate you saying that. Absolutely. And what I want to say to you, the most important thing, even more important than the covenant and the circumcision is whether, because the Quran is saying that your Allah is the same as my God yes. of the Bible, Yahweh. Yes. Allah. Yes. Right? That's what you believe? Yes. Okay, thank you. That's impossible. Okay? Because if that's true, then I have no problem with this now. Okay? My problem is not starting from Muhammad or from Quran or anything like that. That's secondary. My problem is with your Allah. Because Allah can never, ever, ever be the God of the Bible. Okay? Because the God of the Bible, He calls Israel His children. Yeah. And the children of Israel, the Jews, they call Him Father. Yeah. Quran comes along, and now we have a Allah that's saying, I'm the Father to no one. I beget no one. Yeah. All right. Now, of course, everybody knows this, that not the Jews, not the Christians believe that God had sex with any woman to have any sons or son, singular or plural. It's a spiritual relationship, right? So now, how can you tell me now there's another issue? And now this is the issue with the Arabic. And now you're going to tell me you don't speak Arabic. I don't. But I can look into I, I speak a language that has 30 percent Arabic I'm words. I speak in it. Arabic, Turkish. And French. And That's good. Turkey. And Turkey. And English, of course. Yes, English. That's Arabic. very good. My That's Arabic is perfect. That's good. I'm, I'm glad to hear that. My Arabic is not. But the language I speak has 30% of the words from Arabic. Okay. Uh, no, it's uh, Urdu. Urdu, yeah. So 30% of the vocabulary that I use, I can understand 30% of the words Arabic yeah. the speakers yeah. speak. So now, when we look at the Quran and it's saying Allah, and we look at what they're talking about. Are they talking about the because Muhammad's father's name was what? Abdullah. What does that mean? Servant of Allah. Servant of Allah. Now the question arises: If he's servant of Allah, which Allah? Because Allah is also a generic name, right? Okay, is Allah a name or is it a, like a title? Like, is it is it a proper name? Like, like uh, Jesus is a proper name, right? Or like I don't call you a man, I call you by your name, whatever your name is, right? Allah has so got Allah has a name, right? Allah has got 99, 99 names. names. No, those are all these attributes, I understand yeah, that. Yeah. But when you pray to Allah, you don't use those attributes, you say Allah, right? Bismillah, Allah, 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 right? We pray to Allah, yeah. Okay, that's no, what I mean. Yeah. Is Allah mean God or does it, ha is it mean the name of God? It is Allah, the name of God and his attribute as well. I what mean, what, if, what uh, attribute is Allah? Mean, Maybe from a linguistic point of view, we have to go further into this. But my my concern will be is that what you want to ask about, what you looking to ask, if you say the Quran came and Jesus and prayer be upon him and Moses prayer be upon him there before the Prophet Muhammad, and then we have the Quran, so we don't have the same Allah, as you say, or the same God that was the father exactly. of the Jews. Just yes, right. Yeah, and that is an my contention. That. that is my yeah. contention yeah. that Allah of the Quran cannot be the God of the Bible. That's okay? what you say. Yeah. Now, that's my contention and I'm yeah. going to prove it and I'm going to try to prove it. Let's say it that way. Yeah. Because uh, so the, when you say Allah, because Allah means the, right? No. 
What does L mean? L. L. L means what? It doesn't mean L from Elohim because that's also L. L is also Ilah. Now, Ilah is different. Now, Ilah is very interesting because I have the same word in my language, Ilah. Yeah. Ilahi. Ilahi, the word Ilahi yeah, is in my language. Yeah. So I know exactly what Ilah, Ilahi means. Sorry, but Allah is a, de is, is a derivative from either it is because when I ask Muslims this question, they say, well, it means the God. You know, Allah means, Ilah means God. Ilah means God, right? Ilah means, Ilah God. means God, right? Yes. Then if Ilah is God, then why Allah is God? Allah is a name, a name of God. Name of God. Thank yeah, you. Yes. That's very good. Okay. Because if Allah is the name of God, then when you say um, La ilaha illallah, no. La ilah, meaning yeah. there is no ilah except Allah. Mm -hmm. No, it doesn't mean that. In Arabic, La ilaha illallah, it means there is no worship. There is no. It says. There is no one worthy of worship except Allah. Right, Ilah, Ilah. Ilah Ma'bud in Arabic. Right. Ilah means what? God, right? Ma'bud. Ma'bud. No, Ma Ilah means God, right? No, that is that one okay. name. So one say, La Ilah means no God there is except no Allah. Ma'bud. 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 That you so worship. You worship. Yes. So Ilah means to worship. And let me just clear one thing, one point. Mm. When in Arabic we have a word, we may have a lot of meaning. So, ah, yeah? I see. There we so, go. It, no, it's true. Okay. It's true because yeah, yeah. we have, we have. Then we have to look at the concept, right? I mean, the yeah, context. The context. The context yeah. Sorry. Yeah, okay. Of course. So, in that way, it says, "La ilaha." Mm -hmm. lay, there is no one worthy of worship. Yeah. Or ma'bud in Arabic, mm -hmm. illa Allah, mm -hmm. except Allah. So that is how we use it. That's my point. Is that Allah? If it's a name, then that name has a meaning, right? Yeah. Like Rahman has a meaning, right? Or Rahim. Rahim has yeah. a meaning. Rahman doesn't have a meaning. Rahim has a meaning. Mean to be merciful. Rahman, nobody knows what the meaning is. But that's another point. I don't want to go there. I know you're going to say, con say? no. Con yeah. uh, they say compassionate, but that's not true. And anyways, I'm not going there right now. Let's leave that aside. Allah does have a meaning, and you don't know what it means, do you? No, we do. What does it mean? Allah is a is a name given to the Creator okay. that He's chosen for Himself. He chosen for himself. Absolutely. That's a big play. <laughs> All right. Let's go there. I like to go there. Where did he choose this name? When? Where? Is it in the Old Testament? He's called Allah? No. It's not in the Old Why would he not call in, himself Allah? When Moses book. asked him, listen, when Moses asked him, when I go back there, what will I say? Send me. What should I tell them? What did he tell them to say? I have no idea. I am who I am. His name is Yahweh. Oh, you're talking about the Bible? No, no. I'm asking you, if his name is Allah, because there's a point in the Bible where Moses is saying, who are you, what's your name, mm. right? And if he is the one that's in the Quran, mm. his name is Allah. Allah, yeah. And he could tell Moses, go and tell them, tell them Allah has sent you. He doesn't say that. Well, that's, that's your Bible that is made according to John, according to Mark. Okay, let's, uh, okay that's Just another topic, that's another topic. Well, so, absolutely, but that's I fine. Cannot... Okay, so let's say, Brother, let so me... you're saying... What's your name? I go by Uncle Sam. What's yours? Sam or Hisham? Huh? Hisham. Hisham. Yeah. Okay. Hisham, Hisham and Hisham. Hashim and Hisham. It's not a big deal now, you two. Hashim and Hisham. Uh, <laughs> what is the difference between Hashim and Hisham? Hashim. It's the same thing. You see, Hashim, Hisham. It's just a different pronunciation? Uh, yeah. Ha, oh, okay. Ha, so I can call you Hashim or Hisham. Either no, way. Hisham is different. What? Hisham. No, no, it's written different. Right? H-R. Okay. But so the meaning Hashim is the same. Hashim, H-A. Yeah, 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 but the meaning like, is the same. Okay, Hisham, no, Hisham means a lion. Huh? A lion. A lion? Yeah. Oh, okay. I didn't know how she Yeah, and Hisham. Hisham is a liar. Okay. And Hussam is a liar. You see, this is what I meant by saying in Arabic there is a meaning for many words. So if somebody says, What does Azra mean in Arabic? Hazra? Azra. 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 How do you write it? It doesn't mean anything. Oh, you don't know Azra. Okay, Hazra. anyways, there never is, mind. Hazra maybe. Hadra. Oh, what does Hazra mean? Hazra to Filan, your highness. Oh, okay, never maybe. mind. Okay, yeah. let's, let's not go mm. sidetrack too much. Because the point that I'm trying to make is Allah is a very ancient name. It comes from Egypt. Okay? If you look at ancient Egyptian, not the Egypts right now, because they speak Arabic, but the ancient Egyptian language had La in it. Okay? La, L-A-H. Okay. Okay? La. La. And that was referring to the moon god of Egypt. Allah is the moon god of Egypt. Because listen to this, 
Muhammad's tribe, Quraysh, used the chief deity of the Quraysh tribe was what? What was the name of the chief god of the pagans on, in, in, in the in the Kaaba? Abdul Muttalib. What? Al Abdul Muttalib. No, 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 no. Chief god. There were 365 statues in the Kaaba, right? Before Hubal, Islam. Hubal. Hubal. Yeah. You know the name. Thank okay. you for saying that. Thank you, sir. Now, Hubal is a crescent moon god. Now, that clears everything up. Everything. You've actually made my life easy. Because now I don't have to say it. Hubal is the name of the crescent moon god of Quraysh, who were pagans. So they were following Allah because that was the moon god's name from the Egyptian time. So they have this ancient name they were following and they were calling the Hubal. Hubal is also the crescent moon god. You can look it up. I've, I've actually, I've, I've made a lot of videos on this. So everybody knows that I, I've shown all the evidence. So the Hubal worship is crescent moon god worship. Okay. Now, the problem is, your Allah is called Allah, which is the Allah, the moon. I don't accept that. Why? Okay, look. If, it's not if, clear. It's, it's effy. Because obviously, when we, talk, when we talk about evidence, we look for clear. We look for absolute clear evidence. This is absolute clear. Um, it isn't. Why it isn't. Okay, let me la, ask you why not. I tell you, because la mm -hmm. is not a la. No, I'm not saying it's Allah. Hisham is not Hashem. Okay, hold on, hold on. Yeah. What is, okay, La is not what? La is, is what? not Allah. I'm not saying it's Allah. I know, but they, they, if... I'm not saying it's Allah. We are, it's analogy. This is an analogy. Hisham, 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 Hisham. Yeah. Hisham. Hisham. I think we are playing some... Well, let me straighten it out a little bit, okay? Here's what I'm saying. I'm not saying Allah and La have anything to do with one another. If anything, in the name of Allah, the El is a derivative of like the he, uh, Hebrew Elohim. You know Elohim? Have you heard of Elohim? This, no, Elohim is a derivative from uh, Allah. Because, Hold on. Hold because on. Let the me Bible, ask you something. Let me ask you something. Sam, Sam the Bible in Arabic mm. is with us. As well. We have it because you have the Arabic Bible. I do have the Arabic Bible at home. No, no, no. But when was the Arabic Bible written down? It was written wherever. I mean, when that it, it was translated. I mean, obviously, when we talk about the scripture. This is a different. Uh, this is a different uh, subject, maybe to go, to go into. When that Bible came along, and it was. But if there was any scriptures, and if there was any translation, and we know that. You know, it has never been written in English. You know, what? the Bible. The Bible is different language. Yeah, Judaism. Yeah. So if it was translated into Arabic, yeah. it has Allah all over it. Okay, okay, okay. No, so I know that, it does. It does. I know okay. that. Okay, okay. It's called, okay, let's talk about that. Now we are going into that translation thing. It's called dynamic equivalence. Can you remember this term? I'm starving. I want to eat. Okay, you want to go? Come back. I want to eat. Okay. I can come back. No problem. I'll carry on. It's okay. Yeah, we can come back and then we'll find you. There's a canteen over there. There are sandwiches right there. You what see is that the name building? of it? Oh, no, no, it's right there. You can see it. You see that on the right? There's a rooftop on the okay. right. Just okay, go there. Okay. You'll see it. Fab. I'll All see right. you later. I'll see you I'll next catch. time. Thank you. All right. Excuse me, guys. I'm on the camera. All right. So the guy he just took off. He said he has to go eat something, so we're going to have to let it go. Maybe he'll come back and we'll continue with the video.